Okay, my next topic is the overall safety of changing the wheels and jacking the vehicle and using the various products. Now, when you're jacking the vehicle, like I said, for an extended period of time, there should be a jack stand under the vehicle in case the vehicle gets bumped. It doesn't fall off the jack and you won't be able to go and get it back up. And you want to be careful, like, it's jarring the car, just don't jar the car as little as possible whenever you are changing the tire because you do not want this to fall on you. Of course, you can see the um, obvious health risk if that does happen. Now, other safety is um, making sure that you do not let your um, tire go underinflated like where we covered the um, punctures because if you let that go too long, the inner material inside of the tire will eat its way out as you roll along from the weight of the car and there not being enough air and air pressure in the tire. So you don't want that to happen because it may cause a blowout. Then you will have like a driving, driving vehicle accident and um, that wouldn't be good for your health either. So you, know, you just want to make sure that you use the proper equipment, make sure that your jack isn't um, leaking in fluid either because you don't want the car going down and whatnot while you're um, dealing with it. And just you know, just just look out for yourself. Like if you if you had to change your tire on the side of the road, just make sure you get far off to where you're not in the um, oncoming traffic and just other things like that. Just use your own um, common sense, and you should be okay. And that um, covers the safety of um, dealing with tires and jacking the vehicle.